still have the worst sore throat in the world. It was hard getting out of bed today. Like, you know when you just feel really weak? Like, I feel like I'm about to get ill and I don't know whether to like push hard and fight it or whether to like let it take me for a day or two and then I'm gonna have full energy back. Um, I haven't decided yet which one of those two options I'm gonna go for. So instead I just had a, um, I had a peppermint tea, that's the one. As you've hopefully seen by the title of the vlog, today is a super exciting day because the new iPhone X, I'm gonna have to speak quietly because it hasn't arrived yet. The new iPhone X comes out today, today. And I've been lucky enough that I've got two come in, one for me, one for Zoe I ordered, she has no idea. I'm kind of lucky that Zoe isn't really clued on to like release dates of products and games and apps and items and stuff because then it means I can get them for her as a surprise and she has no idea. Yeah, I took yesterday off of vlogging because I was literally just in meetings all day and on the phone all day and doing emails and stuff like that and I had a phone call event, <coughs> well my throat, that I went to last night which was my friend Dave is doing like a little tour around the UK so I went as a guest to that last night which was nice but now we're back vlogging today. It's a super lovely day, it's like super nice and fresh. So last night Poppy and Sean stayed over at our house. You're gonna have to ignore my croaky weird voice today. And this morning we all decided to go out for a lovely breakfast together at a place called Red Rooster in Brighton. It's so nice there. Although I remembered that the new iPhone is coming out today and it's arriving today. So I was like, I can't leave the house and miss the delivery, that would suck. So those three went for breakfast together without me. I stayed in bed drinking my peppermint tea, trying to get my sore throat better. And then after missing the breakfast, the phones didn't even arrive. Like, they still haven't arrived yet. So I'm gutted that I missed breakfast, but at the same time, if I did go for breakfast and the phones arrived and I've missed them, I would have been even more gutted. You win some, you lose some. So this is one of our meeting rooms. Obviously it'll slide differently. Like a policy with like dogs, like if you were bringing a dog to the office or is that like a no or uh, we're in communication. Yeah. Like a little kitchen area. Yeah, yeah, but we can just we get all of that open. Yeah. Yeah. But we get all of them put in. No, I think this is good. Guys, I've just got home now, and if you couldn't tell what we were doing, we were, I don't know if I explained it, we were, yo, know, for this new company that is launching, sorry, I need a wee, I'm like so excited, give me one minute. Then we got to Zoe's office and tell you guys. If you understood what you just saw, Zoe and I went to go look at some new office space, and I'm talking like big office space, sick new office, all getting completely done up, refurbed for the new company that <clears throat> well, my throat still was sore. For the new company that I've been talking about so much, I will be able to tell you fairly soon, I promise. Exciting stuff is coming. How excited? I don't know what it is. No, but what we just did. Oh yeah, really exciting. Like, so exciting. Um, close your eyes. And I'm gonna put something in your hand, okay? Not your dick again. Bloody hell. <laughs> Keep them closed. I've told you I don't like to touch it, Albie. <laughs> Put your hands out, keep your eyes closed. Put your hands out. Open your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you keep doing this The new iPhone came out today. I saw the queues in town. <gasps> were insane. Did you? Oh my god, you know, I saw everybody else getting these and I thought, oh. It has no button. So I, that's why I just upgraded it to the 8 Plus and now I'm going to No, that can be your work phone because you have two phones. The 8 Plus and then this can be your main one. But this... Thank you! This is like... Yo. Can you see it? Yeah, I want to open it so bad. Yo, this is the best bit of an iPhone. Oh, right, oh everyone... I think I should have that one. Oh, yeah, yeah, that, you is one. One, that, yeah. that is your one. That is your one, the Switch. That's better. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I need to do new merch phone cases now. It feels oh, good in God, my hand. It feels really like luxurious. This I'm feels like really it. good. I'm what an exciting out. day. I'm gonna go in. Doesn't this have portrait mode front face camera? Yeah, portrait front face. Bobby's behind the camera. Look at the screen. Oh my God. It's literally massive. Where's the button? I don't know what. Wait, what'd you do? Oh, you slide it up. 
Nice card, English. I did wonder why you wanted me to come and sit with you while you opened your Supreme. Table. I did actually. So I ordered some stuff from Supreme. If you're not Supreme, I'm gonna this, it's like, do this in a bit. I feel like it's I'm like the hardest stop. shop to ever order stuff from because the stuff sells out. Not exaggerating, in six seconds. Like they actually do it in so six seconds. So you ordered? Is this the one that you've been trying to get? I ordered this two months ago. Put in the wrong address. I put in our old house. I then they then failed obviously to make the delivery. Yeah. What was super helpful is that I put in the wrong email as well. I put .co.ul rather than UK. So they emailed me like, I ordered the stuff like two months ago. Then they emailed me a week ago saying, hey, we think you did the wrong email. You did your .ul rather than .uk. And I was like, I'm an idiot. Please can you send us this new address and this. So I've got all my Supreme order Yay! here that I've been waiting for. Is so it like, for Sean as well? No, Sean got all of his. Oh, he's already got his. So I've been waiting for this Supreme order for like two months. I'm so excited. That's cool. <laughs> do you not like it? I do. I think I look cool on you. Load of t-shirts. I've got oh, so cool. much stuff. Anyways, I just wanted to give you the new iPhone. Do you like it? Yeah, you happy? I'm going to go and sort mine out now. Um, right, I need to head back to the office. I'm so excited. You've got a few calls to make. I need to head back to the old office. No. You've got a few calls to make, honestly. Why me? Because you're, you're like the business. You know what I mean? Guys, this potential new office. Basically, we saw, we saw four different offices today and we're torn between two of them. One is smaller, one is half the size of the other one. I think the smaller one, Zoe thinks the bigger one. It's gonna, it's gonna be a shared office, that's all I'm saying. It's gonna, yo, it's gonna be savage. So we got sent some beers the other day. These are all different from a beer subscription that I signed up to. Horny Ball Stout, that's the one. All of these different ones, so we're gonna crack some open. It's Friday, having a cheeky little drink in the office. All right, what drinks are we going for? Who's having what? I want to go for this. F flamingo juice. Whoa! Oh my gosh, what just happened? No way. Look how cool this is. That's amazing. You've got to open your mouth really wide when you drink that. That's so cool. <laughs> I've never seen a can like that in my life. He's so excited. Pop, check that can. Isn't that cool? Is it broken? No, that's what it's meant to do. Does it taste like flamingo juice? Yeah, that's quite good. Mm. I'm, hap fruit? I'm happy with my choice. Just got back from the office and apparently Zoe is doing a Christmas puzzle, which doesn't surprise me at all. What are you doing? What's going on in here? Why are you wearing a sprout? <laughs> a sprout hat. What are you chatting about? That's just her hair. <laughs> Where's this puzzle that apparently you've been doing? <laughs> apparently you've been doing a Christmas <laughs> puzzle. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that is a big old Christmas puzzle. It's <laughs> nearly done. How Hello. did you do it that quickly? Yeah, I love this game. No, you're not allowed to play. <clears throat> yeah, of course she is. Nala doesn't ever go to her, she goes to me. No, she doesn't. She does. No, look, everyone has to put their legs joining in the circle. In a triangle, okay, come sit oh. over here. Oh, I'll put her in the middle. Sit, Nala. Sit down, Nala, sit. Three, two, Don't one. Don't say anything, no one say anything. <laughs> Too smart. 
Poppy, you need to go and wait and give her a dinner. <laughs> go on. Come on. I'll carry the monitor into the car. Where are my shoes? What? Where are my shoes? I haven't got them on. I won't fit in your shoes. No, I threw them in the garden. They've got spiders in them. What? Poppy's borrowing a computer monitor because her laptop screen is all broken. So she can't see her laptop screen. So she's borrowing a computer monitor. Which is actually my project manager's. But she's on holiday at the moment. All jokes aside, we are actually sitting down to do this Christmas puzzle now. You know, crazy Friday night, living it up, doing a Christmas puzzle. I say we, Zoe's finding it difficult to find all of the edges. She's done a very good job so far. There's still more But in there is a lot missing in here. I, mean, I don't know whether 10, to like- 10,000 pieces, not 10,000. 10? 1,000. I was gonna say 10,000 will literally take us until Christmas. I think um, this will take us until Christmas. I don't know whether to, Oh, here's a good one. Is that, that's the missing bit down the bottom there. <gasps> Shut up. Yeah. Okay, that was a good find. I don't know whether to like categorize as soon as I find edges, push them to the side. Like I think so, but also if you find similar colors, make little piles. Do you think? Yeah. Oh. I mean, edges is a priority because once you've got the edges, you can I'll just start, find building, edges. Yeah, I'll just you can find start building into the inside. But do you want me to proper like push them aside ones that aren't edges and like, actually find them all or just have a look? Um, whatever you think. Oh, cheeky little edge. Oh, where is that? Could you pass me the box? Yeah, the bottom is the best bit. That's kind of where I left yesterday's vlog. Man. I mean, I explained in this video that I wasn't feeling very well at the beginning. But why is it always that in the morning, so you can't see me very well. Why is it always in the morning and the evening that you feel so much like, is there an actual reason why that is? Yesterday was so much fun, but now like sitting here just now and editing all of the video up to where you've seen it so far. In the whole video, I'm like this. I feel like such a, I look like such a zombie and that I'm not excited. Yesterday, the video you're watching now, was genuinely one of the most exciting days I've had in a long time. Like, not only did I get the new iPhone X, and I also surprised Zoe with the new iPhone X, but we went to go and view potential new offices for this new company. And when I say off, like, I didn't explain it properly just because I wasn't feeling very good. When I, and I still really don't feel good. When I say offices, I'm talking like big spaces, like the offices that we were looking at yesterday, two of the ones that were particularly, I mean, I've been, I found a couple more online that I want to go and view since then. Yesterday we went to go and view four offices and the kind of vibe that we're going for, for this new company, three and a half thousand square foot, which is probably enough space to have, I don't know, 70, 80 people in the office. There's not going to be that many people because we want the environment, the office has got like a certain feel, there needs to be certain teams within the new company that have their own areas. But when you're seeing the spaces that you saw, which like, I, I didn't really show much. And one of the ones that I did show was all like separate rooms and stuff, like all the walls will be taken out, everything's going to be completely redone, completely redecked, like it's going to be a bloody big project. And I want this new company to really, really be like, flourish in and involved and have all of you guys involved in the vlogs in setting up this new company the new logos the new designs the new office things that we're working on meeting the team like the team the new company is going to have its own instagram going to have its own twitter the team are going to be really really involved i'm going to like film working with the team because at the moment with the people that work on uh on everything to do with me at the moment i don't really put on camera because the team's quite small but once we're going with this new company um it's going to be like life changing, life changing kind of stuff that's happening guys. And I know the vlogs have suffered over the last couple of months and I have warned you a couple of times in videos that because I'm working on something so big at the moment, the vlogs will take a hit for a while because you are like at the moment I, I'm interviewing like over the last two weeks, I've probably interviewed like 10 people for to like join potentially join the team and stuff so i'm in like non-stop interviews non-stop phone calls sorting stuff out non-stop on the phone to my lawyer my accountants really really trying to make this happen in the right way and at the moment because obviously the team is so small it takes so much of my involvement 
which takes away time from the videos. I do understand that. That does suck. That's not the way in which I want it to go, but I do want this new company to, to go, and it's gonna be sick. Um, I just wanted to round that up in the, in the vlog because this vlog seemed a little bit, not dull, I seemed a bit dull in the vlog, and that wasn't the case at all. And then last night when we were doing the puzzle, I just gradually felt more and more and more ill. I was like, oh, and then I just went, like, I literally fell asleep on the sofa half past nine last night, and then woke up at like 11, went up to bed, played a little bit on my PlayStation, and just like crashed out, and I woke up this morning, like, listen to me now, I felt, and I still do feel so ill. But um, I've got a fun vlog planned today, I'm off to, off town to go meet one of my friends for his birthday. <coughs> I just wanted to like round the vlog up. Also, I've set up my new iPhone, it's so sick, look, like Face ID just works. Like, I don't know how it works, but I'm gonna have to spend some time getting used to, like, no button. But I fully set it up, I just don't have a case yet. I need to get a case today. Anyways, I just wanted to, like, round up this vlog, give it a nice ending, let you guys know that I was so excited yesterday, like, beyond excited. It was such a big day for me and the new company and a big day for Zoe. And I didn't want you to be watching the vlog thinking, yo, Alfie seemed a bit off today. I feel really, really ill at the moment, but I'm trying to, trying to fight it, trying to carry on, you know? Trying to eat good, get out there, get some fresh air. Slept with the window open last night to make sure I'm breathing in fresh air. Anyways, I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you so much to everybody who's already given it a thumbs up, who's already subscribed. It means a lot to me. I can also officially tell you that there is new merchandise dropping on the 12th of November. November the 12th, new Christmas merchandise. I'll catch you tomorrow. Goodbye, guys. I'm not a book, 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 I'